Hi folks, so recently I did something that I'd never done before as a professional video journalist, and that is that I used some stock footage to help me tell a story. So I want to show you what I used, why I used it, and then I want to share with you some of my favorite sites where you can download really high quality uh, stock footage clips absolutely free. If you remember, recently I was in Washington, D.C. Uh, to produce a video about a gentleman who works at the World Bank, and I did a vlog about how to conduct an interview. I set up a time to conduct an informal phone interview with the subject. Well, the gentleman who works at the World Bank runs the Climate Change and Health Program, and when I was interviewing him, so much of his work involves uh, the environment and how this global climate change impacts human health. So I really needed to illustrate uh, this connection between environment and health. So I went to some stock footage that I had previously downloaded and I used it to um, introduce the video. And uh, I'm gonna show a piece of that right now and I'd be really curious to know your thoughts in the comments below. Humans fundamentally are a part of the environment and we are subject to the same impacts and influences of the natural world. Climate change will have impacts on vector-borne disease, on malnutrition, on respiratory diseases. I founded and lead the Climate Change and Health Program at the World Bank. So all of those clips were stock footage, except for the last one where he was walking in front of the giant globe. And I was really happy with how that came out because I think it worked really well with what he was talking about. And actually my client really loved it. They loved the video. So that was very successful. So now I wanna show you a couple of the sites that I go to frequently and I just browse around and if a clip uh, catches my fancy, I'll download it, stick it in a folder. You never know when I might wanna use it. All right, so there are three sites that I, I wanna share with you. The first one is called Cover and you can see that it just has a real great variety of different clips. And all you do, you just you click on one. This is a nice looking generic one. I usually look for generic clips. So you just click on it and you can download it and easy peasy, you stick it in a folder and you can pull it out anytime you need it. The next one is called Pexels. And again, a lot of different shots, a good variety of shots. Uh, you can search as you can on the other ones. Um, let's look at, um, let's look at time-lapse. Time-lapse, let's just click on this one. We can watch it. Now that's a pretty cool looking clip. Now one thing, make sure that you never try to pass these clips off as your own. I mean, that would just be wrong. But if you're trying to illustrate something in a narrative story, these clips can come in very handy. And as you can see up here, it's a free download. You can use it any way you want. And the last one that I wanna show you is called Life of Vids. Read right here, free videos, clips and loops, no copyrights, restrictions, personal and commercial. You can use it pretty much any way that you want. And again, some really nice, pristine video. This one actually is uh, linked to Vimeo, so you'd have to go to Vimeo, and then you can click download, and you get a whole variety of uh, download options from standard definition all the way up to the original file. So those are three sites that I go to. Uh, I, I'm really impressed with the quality of those clips. Again, I don't use a lot of stock footage, but it's good to have in a, if you need it in a pinch, which obviously I did with this video that I did of the gentleman at the World Bank. Um, and again, I'd really like to know your thoughts. Personally, I think that intro to the World Bank video worked perfectly. It did exactly what I wanted it to do. Um, I'm curious about your thoughts. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.